Randall M. Roof doesn't do it for the money. He just loves to take pictures. <laughs> <laughs> Here, call sign is K9RMR. Uh, had a situation the other day. I got a letter in the mail from uh, Mr. William Smith of Fountaintown, Indiana. And here's what happened I was on the radio, got my little Kenwood uh, THD 74, nice radio. I love this radio. Um, anyway, I made that contact and uh, talked for about five minutes, uh, so I sent uh, looked him up on QRZ.com, sent him a uh, QSL card, and yesterday in the mail, I got this letter. Okay, I was expecting a QSL card in return. Uh, Mr. William Smith, Fountaintown, Indiana, dated eleven seventeen, which is. Today's the 22nd, so it's a few days ago, several days ago. Dear OM. I don't know what that means. OM. OM. Right here. Dear OM. Operator M. I have to look that one up. Okay, I've been a 100% CW operator for 66 years plus. Long time. Long time I've been alive. Uh, if you are not. If you are not mistaken about the call you worked, it was a pirate. Although it is hard to believe a pirate would use a 1 by 2 call that is easy to remember. Over 20 years ago, I had a call from a ham over around the Indiana-Ohio border who complained of my, my mobile station causing interference there. Uh, if the same pirate is again active, we need to try and get the FCC involved. Please let me know if you hear him regularly and what time of day slash frequencies. The only time my call is used for radio telephone is for the GOTA or get on the air station uh, for our radio club, Hancock Amateur Radio Club for field day every June. Very 73's Bill N9TT. I'll show you that. So apparently... I'm pretty sure I got this guy's call sign right, because he, he's, um, uh, I'm pretty sure, I'm 95% sure I got it right, because uh, I checked it several times, and he said it was N9TT, so, somebody's using a call, more than likely somebody's using a call sign that's not theirs, according to this letter, so if you hear N9TT, and he's not Morse code, Except with the exception of field day, uh, somebody's transmitting illegally uh, using a uh, call sign that's not their own. So there you go. Um, they got a QSL card that with a guy I didn't actually make contact with. That's not a big deal. Um, but uh, Bill, if it happens again, uh, this in ninety somebody claiming. Local repeaters uh, give it a signal. Um, if it's N9TT, or so the person claiming to be N9TT, um, transmits, uh, and I talk to them again, which I seriously doubt, but it could happen, um, I'll make a note of it and react appropriately. Um, so, I just want to make a little note about what, what happened and... Um, this is the first time this has happened. Um, one time before, I did get one where I got the call sign call came talk, got the call sign incorrect, um, and which normally doesn't happen because normally when they tell you when you get their call sign and you're sure it's pre pretty sure it's what you're hearing what they said correctly, and you go on QRZ.com, I mean they normally say, "Hey, I'm from Dayton, Ohio," or "I'm from." Springfield, Illinois, or wherever they're from, they you know they say they're calling. They say, "Hey, I'm traveling through the area. Uh, my call sign is so and so. I'm from so and so." And when you go on QRZ.com, you can say, "Ooh, there's their call sign." That's they said they were from 
let's just say Dayton, Ohio. It says Dayton, Ohio in their address. Um, so, um, but there was, there was a time before where I got a call sign wrong. And I looked up on QRZ Cinema, Cinema Q, uh, QSL card. They sent, they even sent the QSL card back to me. Um, saying it wasn't them. I obviously got the call sign wrong, which in that case I did. Um, in fact, it was after that uh, incident that I started making sure I got the call sign correct. And I say, could you please repeat your call sign um, to make sure I've got it recorded correctly for my log. But... Uh, Bill in 90 t again, I appreciate you taking the time to write a letter. I don't know what Dear OM means. I'll have to look that one up. Maybe it's, um, I don't know. Anyway, yeah, appreciate you taking the time to write the letter. Uh, and if it, like I said, if it happens again, I'll make sure to respond appropriately. Uh, for everybody else, uh, this is just a day in the life of Randall and Ruth, myself, K9RMR, doing my radio thing uh, occasionally. So until next time. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. God bless. And of course, 73.